We're here with Heintrap 1983, just before a sold out gig in Wheelands, Dublin. We're going to ask him a few questions before he goes. Um, so, Jordy. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for well, Thank you for having me. I mean, yeah. Um, I suppose one of the first questions I wanted to see was, um, if for someone that hasn't heard you, is there any song of yours that you would recommend they listen to to kind of get a, an idea of what you sound like? All right, yeah. Well, um, I think um, one, of, one of the songs that represents me the most is uh, uh, Let's Talk, which uh, I did with uh, uh, Josh Daly. Yes. It's uh, of my album Reflections, and it's just that romantic kind of vibe which I love making and uh, which um, uh, shows my music best I think that's uh, uh, one of my favorite songs and Brilliant. if there's any song people I recommend listening to to, to get into my music and be uh, let's talk with uh, George Daly yeah let's talk okay <laughs> And then, like starting off and stuff, um, is there a moment that like you can think of that kind of helped make you, or, or kind of it started to become more of a uh, kind of a break for you? Yeah, definitely. Okay, it, it was. Um, it, it was pretty much in the beginning when I first released. Uh, uh, I think it was Lonely Nights, which which was my first song I ever released. Uh, I put it online on SoundCloud and. Um, uh, a few months later, I, I did uh, Childhood Memories, yes. um, which is on, on my first album. And um, when I put that online, it got picked up by New Retro Wave, the, the, the oh, YouTube yes. channel. Yes. And ever since then, things got so big. And yeah, I, I never released any music before. So Lonely Nights and Childhood Memories was my, my first music I put, ever put out in my life. Yeah. And uh, it got picked up by New Retro Wave. And yeah, it was. It just took off from there. I never expected it to be so big. And yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, it's been crazy. That's so. That's really a takeoff from my musical career. Yeah, yeah, yeah of course. listen to at the moment that you'd recommend people to, to listen to yeah well I, I listen to a lot of music and a, a lot of bands and uh, lately I've been listening to a lot of Wolf Club yes um, yeah, yeah. from uh, from the UK and yes. I just love their They're stuff great. their their new album is great and um, yeah I listen to them a lot brilliant okay yeah. excellent and then I suppose finally is there any projects you're working on songs albums coming up uh, that we should listen out for yeah I'm always working on new music, uh, although I must say lately I've been having kind of a, a writer's block, right. <laughs> but um, I hope I get over it soon, but uh, um, I'm working on a new EP. Uh, yes. My initial plan was to release it before summer of 2019, but summer is almost over, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and it's still not finished yet, but um, working on it and uh, I just want it to be perfect and uh, there's one song on there. Uh, which is a collaboration with Josh Daly, which I did last talk with as well. Yes, yeah. And uh, that is going to be like the, the, the main focus of the EP, which is, yeah, the most important song and everything's going to be built around it. So uh, that's what I've been working on lately and uh, I hope to release it as soon as possible, but not sure when. Perfect. Yeah. And then on Facebook websites, where should people check you out? Uh, I have a website, timecom1983.com. Uh, I have you can find me on Facebook, Spotify, Instagram, Instagram. <laughs> whatever, pretty much everything. Perfect. But uh, uh, it's all accessible through my website, timecom1983.com. Perfect. Okay. Well, best of luck with the show tonight, and thank thanks you. for your time. Thank you for having me again. Yeah, no problem.
Thank you.